Good afternoon, Emmanuel family and friends. You know, 12 Sundays is a long time. That's how long it's been since we were able to gather in this space in person. And this space is so incredibly sacred to us. Um, and while we know that the church didn't close because the church doesn't close, we are the church. We also know that our fellowship depends on meaningful connections. And we haven't been able to have the types of connections we want over these last 12 Sundays. Uh, so with that in mind, I bring you good news. Uh, we will be meeting for in-person worship this Sunday. Uh, your church council met last night and made that decision as Louisiana has moved into phase two of reopening. Uh, and there's a lot of different uh, recommendations we've heard. There's a lot of different emotions we've felt. On one hand, we feel an incredible sense of joy and hope and also some relief as we open up because we know we need something familiar. But at every step of the way, we've tried to be wise and responsible and compassionate. And we've tried to trust God's leadership through all of this. Um, let me tell you some of the guidelines that we're having to follow and some that we're putting into place to be extra cautious. Um, according to state guidelines, we can open up at 50% capacity and that would be 375 people. And the only time we ever exceed that is Christmas Eve and Easter Sunday. But we're not going to have 375 places to sit, I can tell you that. Uh, we have some concerns about how congregational singing contributes to the spread of COVID-19. So we're trying to space people apart 12 feet. Um, we're also going to try to have a shorter service than we normally would with less congregational singing. Uh, we're not gonna have childcare available. We're not gonna have a choir like we're used to. Uh, we're not gonna have uh, Sunday school groups meeting on Sunday morning or a fellowship time in Weems Hall with coffee before the service. We won't have any of this. Um, now here's what you, uh, what we're asking of you as we gather, if, if you come this Sunday and for the next few Sundays. Um, first of all, if you are sick or if you're showing any signs of illness, if you're at high risk for COVID-19, we respectfully ask that you stay at home and worship with us online from there. Uh, the live stream will continue to be made available and that's going to look a little different because we've had to move all the AV equipment up to the balcony so the angle will look different. But in a few weeks, we'll have our new audiovisual equipment installed. And, and so we're hoping for a best case scenario there with how that looks and how it sounds. Uh, the other thing we're asking you to do is use the Jackson Street doors to, to come into the church and to exit. The Rose Garden entrance will be available for those with mobility issues, but everybody else use the J Jackson Street doors. Um, if you have a mask, we encourage you to wear it. Our ushers and, and representatives will be wearing masks and make use of the hand sanitizing stations when you come in and when you leave. Uh, we have marked off the places to sit. Uh, we've taken out uh, many of the pew cushions. So if you see a place that has a pew cushion and a worship guide, then please sit there and um, also bring, uh, bring your Bible from home because we don't have the pew Bibles and we don't have the hymnals, we're trying to limit the kind of high touch areas that we all have access to. Uh, and the other thing we ask is that you not linger in the sanctuary having long conversations uh, following the service. We can have those brief conversations outside. I know we miss each other, uh, but that's the best place for it. And just know that it's probably gonna feel a little strange. This is not what Sunday mornings at Emmanuel are typically like, uh, but understand we're all getting through this together and we're. We're trying to follow the guidelines that are given to us while at the same time being mindful of protecting ourselves and our families and our neighbors and our community. Um, and then finally, let me say this. I know that many of you won't be here this Sunday. Uh, you've said that you're gonna stay at home for a few weeks, maybe even a, a few months out of uncertainty of where this thing goes. Uh, please know that we respect that decision. We honor it. We will miss you dearly. And I hope that you will continue to find meaningful ways to connect with your church family because it's so important. Um, but most of all, I just want to say thank you so much for being church to each other. Uh, not only over these last few weeks, but before that and in the days to come, there truly is no body of believers in the world like the people of Emmanuel Baptist Church. And so um, whether I see you online or in person, I'll see you this Sunday. God's peace be with you, and God's peace be with us all.